hello so in this video we are going to look at an interesting module called as path auto so first of all let's discuss why do we need path auto now when you install drupal to view any page or anything or any content that you create we know that it assigns it a node number let's say if we go to content and have a look at what content we have here is different kind of contents are there so there is a page called as drupal roles fine now if i edit this right you will notice that it has been provided a node number if we edit this the node number is 27 so basically like uh, if you take this and you go to this you will see that page which is referred by this particular node number fine now the other thing is drupal provides a mechanism of url alias and so here uh, whenever i'm creating an article or content or maybe you're using drupal as a blog or something it's a good idea to have consistency in the url how it is made so usually like if you have a blog you might want to have your blog post uh, given as blog slash maybe it's um, main uh, category like it is under linux drupal content management system then maybe it's divided by date month of creation year of creation and then the title now you can do that manually by writing it over here every time but what happens is then it does not remains consistent so we would want this to be generated automatically so for that we can use an interesting module called as path auto which you can check out on this drupal page path auto from here this can be downloaded this depends on another module called as tokens fine so what token does is basically token gives us tokens which are replaced at the runtime fine so like uh, if i put node dad node colon author so that token will be provide will automatically provide the author of that page then date created and so on so i can provide a pattern and that pattern can be used for this so now i have already installed this over here in my drupal setup this is already there the modules are installed and enabled fine so i have my modules installed somewhere here path auto and token both are installed so now what we need to do is we need to create a url pattern so for that you simply go to your configuration and under that search and metadata and over here go to url aliases for token you don't have to do anything now here you will see the url aliases we go to the pattern settings and here we will add a path auto pattern now you can generate pattern for many different things but we want to generate pattern for our content fine so the content which we want is say the article and here is what we want to give the patterns now i want my article to be like article from my site name onwards article after this i want to segregate it into date and time so here let's go to the browse available tokens so here you will see the tokens related for different things now i want the article should be like article year month and then date and so on now here for that purpose relating it to the node we go to nodes and in the nodes you will have the author name also you will get the title also and other things so if you scroll down you will get the date created part over here fine so here there are different you can see date formats which you can use where you have a fallback date custom date you can directly put something like this because there are hyphens in that already you can have a month but it comes like this you can have a time week fine html year is there so we can uh, use this fine now if you want some custom date made over here so what we will do is we'll click on custom now what is to be done here in custom is the question mark has to be replaced with the date format now that uh, what would be the thing that comes over here if you go to the tokens again this is a php style thing you can go to nodes and let's just go to the date thing 
date created and here you will see in custom it says see the php documentation so if you go to the php documentation you will get a list of what character represents what so here capital d represents monday to sunday small d represents date in two digits this is what i am looking for small d then i am looking for month month i will be looking in terms of like this january february so capital m and year i know it is capital y for the complete year fine so i'll use capital y for the complete year so here what i will do is first one i'll replace it with capital y we'll copy this and place the pattern again over here fine then node created we will say m fine m is what we noticed was uh, this is a numeric representation of month no we want a capital m over here so i'll set it as a capital m and finally again the last one we will set it as a date right small d let's just confirm that again small d no small d yeah small d is day of the month in two digits with leading zeros fine so leading zero makes it much more better looking so let's paste it again i think no i've already pasted it let's get back and set it to small d right now this is created and the last one i want is the node title so let's go to this go back to nodes and here you will find there is a title so node title now my path is ready if you want to see how it looks let me just put it on the editor here this is how our custom path looks like fine so article is a fixed word and these will be token replacements from the date created and other things okay now let me save this we have to give a label article url okay now let's save this now our url is your pattern is ready so if we go back over here fine let's view the page fine here it says localhost drupal cms and something now if i edit this okay and here i will see that generate url alias fine first of all let me remove this to make sure it does not use the old one i'll click this and now let's save this and see if our url pattern is generated correctly or not so now here you can see the whole path or the pattern that we were looking for is generated let me put it on the editor so that it's easier for you so article 2023 whenever it was created november 19th and drupal rules this is the title of the page drupal rules now what happens is there are some settings you can explore in the path auto this is you can generate the pattern fine where the separator wherever there is a space in your title or that will be separated by a space fine character case convert to token values to lower case so everything is lower case then length and other things are there and the other thing that it does is it removes certain of these uh, words which are usually not required in your url fine so that is how you can generate url aliases automatically for your different content types and other things also so that's it about the path auto module from drupal